IBA is a Belgian company. Uh, was founded in 1986 uh, by Yves Jongen and headquartered in Wallonia, Louvain-la-Neuf. And historically, it's a spin-off of the University of uh, Leuven, so Catholic University of Leuven. And uh, since then, it had become a, a real, I would say, success story for Wallonia, uh, being today worldwide operation, had 2,000 people on the payroll, and being in different parts of the industry, uh, therapeutic and uh, diagnostic, also quality control in medical uh, applications. So it has a very wide range as such, but in a very niche market. Belgium as such has a big uh, heritage in nuclear technologies. And when it comes uh, to the radio uh, pharmaceuticals or uh, radiotherapy subject, uh, Yves Young and the founder of IBA, uh, he was the leader of uh, radiation technologies at the university uh, in Louvain-la-Neuf, and that brought him uh, to develop the first modern kind of cyclotron. So hence, um, I guess all those tens and tens of years, and by now almost a hundred years of uh, nuclear innovation uh, brought us there where we are today. And what is also very important, uh, with particularly nuclear technology focusing particularly on cancer, which is one of the major threats to life, or uh, also cardiology these days more and more. Um, it's something that gives a, speci a specific answer uh, to a medical need. Proton therapy is historically uh, had a neck cancer, uh, prostate cancer, which are the biggest uh, subjects as of today in clinical use. And there, IBA, with being the first real clinically routine solution and coming back from the late 90s, uh, being the pioneer to make this a real standard clinical protocol. IBA was in Asia already long years ago, so the first ever supplied machine was still back in the 80s, and then we started operation um, in the later 90s, having a first uh, a facility uh, in China, uh, where we had a substantial amount of people working, first on the promotion, later on even production, uh, then we came with radio pharmacies, so really the production of the pharmaceutical itself, uh, where we had pharmacies here in Asia, and now just lately here in Singapore, uh, the first IBA uh, proton therapy installation, Parkway Hospital, uh, which is a real breakthrough because proton therapy is something still rather new. We have for long years proton therapy in China, Japan, but Southeast Asia, for example, hasn't got a, a real history on proton therapy. And there we are now about installing uh, the machine, looking forward to have that uh, started very, very soon to allow uh, Singaporean and also with all the medical tourism here around in Asia uh, to profit on this uh, breathtaking technology. Say so in the biomedical sphere, obviously a big player, but we are playing in a niche, so in a global sense of Wallonian GDP, it's obviously not at the same level as you would have with a company like Swift or so. But uh, our main revenue comes 95% from overseas business. So hence, uh, while we are installing at this moment two projects in uh, Belgium, one in Wallonia, uh, proton therapy projects, uh, we are clearly towards the world a big ambassador for Belgium and as such, I believe, bring very good image back to Wallonia and Belgium as such um, with the subject we're working on and, like I said, with this innovative power that we bring out to the planet.